Kids are going back know, in their dance. I know, it's horrible. But driving is great. Driving is great. I will drive anywhere. I will drive anybody anywhere. Doesn't matter. So you have your light. You got your license. Yeah, no. got my license. Yeah. The day of my birthday, and um, it's great. I will drive anybody anywhere. Have I'll you got any tickets yet? No tickets. I'll really? probably get one tomorrow. No tickets yet. Well, you've only been driving for less than a year. Yeah, but all my friends have gotten tickets. I've had friends in accidents, and they've only been driving a week. <laughs> oh, that's. Certainly something to be proud of. Yeah, yeah. It's not, I don't think that's old enough to drive. I really don't. I, I think it's... So you just volunteer to do any errand or anything? Oh, yes. Long I'll go involved. to the grocery store. I'll do anything just so I can drive. Yeah, so you really, get, so you really like it. Do you drive a stick it. or an automatic? Automatic, although everybody's disappointed when you say you drive an automatic. They're like, oh, you drive an automatic. Right, right. Well, I drive an automatic. <laughs> well, you can learn to drive a stick. You know. I, I don't know how to drive a stick. I oh, just, you do? I just stall all the time, so... No, no, you see, that's... That's knowing not how to drive a stick, stalling. Well, I know how to do it, I just don't do it right. Right. That's like saying, I can write, I can't form sentences or words. I mean, I can form, but, oh, you can, you're stalling all the time. Right, right. Well, I stall. So I have an eye. And how are things at home now? You're on TV now? Tell me, how did oh, you get this job? Oh, that's Um, Well, I've auditioned since I was seven. I've been working since I yeah. was seven. So this was just an audition that I went right. on, and it takes about five interviews to get something like a series. Yeah. And then it's just a pilot, and then you don't know if it'll be a series. So I went to producers and directors a few mm -hmm. times, and then ABC, and then Warner Brothers, and um, finally you get the part, finally. Right. But the worst is going to the network and to the heads of, of the company. It's scary, but it's, it's fun. It's fun. I love it. Oh, sure. Imagine this. So you should get an allowance and all that kind of stuff? Yeah, or? I get an allowance, and I take out the trash, and I clean my bathroom, so I'm a normal kid. Yeah. I get really? No, no, normal kids do not take out the trash or clean their bathroom. I think you're wrong. Yeah, I guess I'm an abnormal kid. Yeah. Well, I do all those things. Are your parents pretty strict about that kind of stuff? Well, I'm not too strict, but yeah. I'm expected to do them. Yeah, yeah my, my family keeps me. Now, when you take out the trash, you put it in the car and then drive it somewhere? Is it... No, I don't. Although, that's a great idea. I should actually oh, yeah, take it yeah, to the that. dump, then I get to drive. Yeah, no, I don't, but I do take out the See, trash. See, I come from a small town, and we used to drive to the dump. Ew. People don't do that here. That's horrible. Oh, it was great going I to the dump. Never, I would never, I actually, I would not drive to the dump. Oh, no, there's great stuff at the dump. <laughs> and I bet it smells really oh, good, beautiful too. birds and everything at the dump. <laughs> they don't have dumps here in California, no. I guess. Did you grow up here? Well, you're still growing. You're only 16. Yeah, I guess so. I keep thinking. <laughs> yes. But yes. you were born out here and the whole thing? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Any boyfriend? California girl. Boyfriend? Yeah. Anybody? Yeah, yeah. I was teasing you about this because yeah, I know. You're teasing me about this. You're going out with that, uh, yeah. who's that little punk, Joey Lawrence from Blossom. Yeah, no. He's yeah, a nice that guy. little punk. Yeah, Joey. He's great. He's great. But it's really hard to go out with someone who works too. And I see him like once a week sometimes. Yeah. It's, it's really difficult. Yeah, but, so. but it's great. It's great. It's really fun having a boyfriend. I love it. Yeah? Yeah. I so love it. Now, how long have you been going out? Like a year. Oh, that's, well, that's a long time. Yeah, but yeah. we both just started driving, so we never went on car dates. Now we go on car dates. Really fun. But the parents always had to, like, drop you off, and now you don't... It's not as great as it sounds. I mean, yeah, it's no, fun. I mean, <laughs> car date is not like it. It's, wait, it's wait, fun. this car date business. It's just, right. it just, Does it he just pick you up or you pick him up? Depends. Depends. He usually likes to pick me up. Okay. But going on a car date means you just you go in a car and they take you home. It's nothing big. Like, where would you go? Where would you go on a car date? We go to dinner and the movies. That's it. That's the only thing to do. There's nothing else. That's all we do. You're not talking to your old man now, all right? Please. Yes, my father's my father's we'll be right back right after this. No, no. <laughs> Jay and Kelly will return in a moment. <laughs> what was the last date? Where did you go? Where did we go? Um, let's see, we went out to dinner. And that's it. <laughs> oh my god. That's it? That's it? <laughs> yeah, we went to dinner. That's dinner it. and that's it. Just, that's it. Just yeah. protest like too much there a little bit there. <laughs> dinner and that's it. So where did you go? What did you do? Like Denny's? Coke? Jer Jerry's Deli. That's where Jerry's we went. Jerry's Deli. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. My favorite restaurant's Chin Chin. But yeah. anyway. We so what was the last movie you saw? With um, the last movie I saw was Batman, which was awesome. You like how that's Yes, it? and because I saw Batman, I am taking kickboxing lessons. You're taking kickboxing, I, boxing? I, kickboxing now? lessons. I want to look like Michelle Pfeiffer in <laughs> that movie. It's a really? great movie. Yeah? Yeah, you really get cool. the costume Have you seen it yet? No. I did see yeah, it. Yeah, I, yeah, did see it. I did see it. It was cool. Have you started kickboxing yet? Not yet. I'm, I'm starting it. Oh, okay. Because I have to be able to protect myself. Since Against I'm Joey? <laughs> no, when I go to college, you know, oh. when I'm away from everybody else I know, I have to be able to, you know... Well, let's do it. Intimidate people in some kind of way because I'm just, you know. It's good to be able to intimidate people in some <laughs> kind of way. <laughs> well, let me ask you a little about the show now. You've gotten uh, good critical acclaim from the show. I know the show wasn't doing too well there. I think it's had a big Well, I mean, we never come in first place because we're up against 60 Minutes. Oh, so, yeah. But our audience is completely different than 60 Minutes. It's just that their audience is bigger. Yeah. Anyway, um, 
Our, our Boy, you should be a politician. That's a great answer. <laughs> our audience is, is more kids. Right. And, um, and so our audience, I think, is very loyal. And that's, I think, why we got picked up this year, because we do have a very loyal audience. And um, there was a big letter writing campaign. Well, I like the idea of the show. You have Chris Burke in the show, who yeah. has, uh, I don't know if you've seen him, very uh, talented kid. He's got, Great. He's got Down syndrome, yes. and he plays someone But who he's has really Down good syndrome. for having Down syndrome. I mean, yeah. He's in the top one percentile. He's great. He is the neatest guy in the world. I think when the show is over, I will miss him the most. Yeah. He, yeah. Um, I love coming to work with him every day. How many years have you done it now? This is our fourth season that we'll be going Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, so we've been on a long time. It's my family now. It's, mm -hmm. it's where I, I just love it. It's wonderful. But, so before you did that, what did you do mostly? Commercials? Commercials and lots of food commercials. They always hired me to eat in commercials. And then I like, did it. Like food? Like what? Like I did a Fritos commercial. And to this day, I will not eat Fritos. Because really? when you do a commercial, you like eat and eat and eat whatever they have you eat. Tell like, me about it. Yeah. Like, like yeah, crunching you know, off. Do you actually eat Doritos? Uh, I you eat my body do? weight every day in Doritos. <laughs> I'm sure you do. Oh. I don't eat Fritos anymore. I mean, no, you, don't, you can't eat them because no. you just and I didn't, they, But they always make you spit them out. Yeah, the spit bucket? You right, spit bucket? I did that. And, nope. I did, and then I did a brownie commercial, but I wouldn't spit it out. So I got really sick. I ate like brownie.